a view of the rear of the clubhouse here at Deerwood Country Club, the home course for one good golf hole. Very thankful for that. You can see a pool going in over there. Going to be zero entry. Part of the massive renovations that are going on here at Deerwood, both with the clubhouse and now the golf course here. This is the 10th. A very interesting par four. As you can see, hard dog leg left. That's actually the green over there on the other side of the lake. And as you can hear, can get a little gusty out here. This lake is big enough, sort of the midsection of the golf course. You zoom over there to 11 T and you got a tee shot where you have to deal with some water over there on your left. Can be challenging for sure. George Cobb, your course architect for Deerwood. It was first introduced in 1960. George Cobb had some work that he did in Augusta National Golf Club for the par three course up there for Bobby Jones and the folks. Expansive practice area here at Deerwood. Practice greens and then you get into the range over here. We're gonna play number three today out here at Deerwood, the par four, and we're looking over at the tees from the par three second green. And something else you need to understand about this place, love the fall offs all around these greens out here. Deerwood Country Club, the third hole, a par four, playing at about 340 from the tees I'm gonna play from today. Gotta make the choice here, a little bit of a tight driving area. Do you go something shorter than driver? I'm hitting driver. I need to get it down there. You got water to the right that will come into play. However, not for me as much. And then a tough green to get to, a tough pin if it's back right. Although that green will slope from left to right and do a lot of the work for you. So a little bit of wind off the right and into us, but not enough to impact the shot selection. Right, this is kind of that pin I was talking about back there. It's not all the way back right, but I'm vertically challenged both in terms of my height and my ability to hit high soft shots. So this will probably be left. Maybe try to get it up into the ramp. Maybe in that bunker. We'll see. And I was up. Short of that bunker. There's another little look at that green, kind of a peak die sort of design there. So a little bit of a side green view here. So this is what we're looking at. If you sort of bail left, you're left with this one right here. You got to really try to use the contour of the green for this next shot. Hopefully, hopefully we'll land it just in line with that rake, just on and it'll feed back, hopefully. Look at that. Uphill putt. Doing some resurfacing here. Major renovation coming to Deerwood in less than a year's time, but sort of the railroad tie look and a look back to the tee box. Back up that hill now after falling down from that shelf. Got a little uh, patch to work through here. Tap in bogey, we'll take it. 